Hi, welcome to the show. Today and tomorrow we're filming right here at the top of the Aigu de Midi in Chamonix, so we figured we'd do some climbing dailies while we're at it. To start off today's show, we've got a roundup of what's been a very good month so far in Britain. There's been some super hard repeats. Here's the highlights. Eighteen-year-old Ellis Butler Barker was at first, becoming the youngest Brit to climb 8C plus by making the second ascent of Ken Palmer's Brian at Ansi Cove in Devon. James McAfee was next, taking the third ascent of Megalopa 8C Plus at Lower Pentruin in North Wales, before joining forces with Pete Robbins to claim, 28 years after the first ascent, the first repeat of Johnny Dawes' three-pitch E8 slate route, Cur de Leon. Speaking of Johnny Dawes, check out this video of him climbing with something of a self-imposed handicap at Stanage in the English Peak District. I think it's, it's worth anybody trying um to, to walk up slabs, um, they'll learn a lot about how to move and how to trust their body, what their body is really capable of. Big thanks to Wayne Sherricks for the footage. Having fallen off quite a few of the Standage Classics myself, I can attest that they are not easy even when you can use your hands. So, from short rock climbs to the biggest alpine routes, we've got an interview with PLA door winner Alesh Chezen. Alesh, you've been awarded the PLA door. Congratulations. Yeah. Thank you. And you come from a real climbing family. Tell us about your, your family and your climbing history. My, my father was, uh, was a king climber, still, still is, uh, although he's a bit older now. Uh, so ever since I can remember, uh, my life was involved with climbing. Uh, so like our typical vacations was not at seaside, like Norman Slovenian family, but somewhere, usually somewhere in France, in France actually, climbing uh, stuff. And uh, in Slovenia, are you known as Tomo's son, or are you now like your own man? Is it starting to... Yes, starting to sometimes I can feel that I'm not actually myself, but son of someone, but things changed, for, of course. So tell us about the route that you've been you awarded the PLA to offer on Hagshu. So the route uh, we did was in north face of Hagshu, a mountain in Indian Himalaya. Uh, it was a really nice climb. Uh, I. I can say very safe climb, but objectively very safe climb. Um, the tricky part was maybe not the climb, the phase itself. It was the most technical, but uh, we had pretty good idea what uh, can we expect there. Um, the biggest unknown for us was uh, how to traverse to the main summit and then descend uh, back down on the other side. So it was kind of mysterious for us what's going to happen if everything will went smoothly or not. Uh, it turned out everything was fine, but it was quite tricky, some sections. Uh, but it was a big adventure. So we're here at the PLA door. What is your opinion on the um, climbing as a competition? It should not be a competition, although maybe subconsciously sometimes it is, but if Climbing in big mountains uh, would be competition or is taken like competition. I think it can be really dangerous, deadly dangerous. So it should not be part of, of it. And for you personally, I mean, I know you don't see this as a competition, but where do you want to go from here with your climbing? Do you want to, how do you want to go bigger and better? It's uh, not like that this award changed things uh, a lot for me. I mean, I'm not saying that uh, I, I'm not accepting it, but it, it's not like one step 
further one step was just climbing these mountains, uh, this mountain. And so yeah, further I, uh, I still want to climb some some big things. I want to try myself at uh, maybe sometimes at uh, a bit higher altitude. We are going uh, to climb on Alaska with Luca next month, and for now that's the only plan. And after we'll just see what happens. Well, enjoy the weekend. And congratulations on the award and good luck in Alaska. Yeah, thank you very much. Thanks very much for talking to us. Thanks to Alesh for the interview and congratulations on the award. We'll see you tomorrow.